what's going on damnation and hey, y'all welcome back to the vid man so what we got here i'm gonna go ahead and as y'all see from the title i'm gonna help y'all out because you know like i have this issue and i'm trying to figure out like you know how to have them good quality photos while using my phone while editing my phone and i've been you know i've been doing a lot of a lot of my stuff on my phone anyway like right now i'm recording off my phone you feel me? So, you know, so as y'all know, I went ahead and did a photography vlog over here, you know, back with the homegirl Aurora, real calm, cool, collective, got some good shots and everything as well. So I'm basically, I'm going to go ahead and show you guys what I use, you know, the apps I use to go ahead and to create, you know, the pretty, pretty nice photos. You feel me? So let me go ahead and give it to you. So the first thing that I usually use is I use Lightroom, of course. So I go ahead and use Adobe Lightroom, uh, the mobile version. And honestly, you can get a lot out of the mobile version. You know, it's really just pretty much simple. And you know, I do like the preset edits that they do have as well. So sometimes I use those, but I go ahead and do just edit them a little bit, just to like, you know, of course, you know, make them all unique style. So I'm gonna go ahead and click this photo right here, right? Now I'm gonna go ahead and add some, you know, little color to it, high definition. Yep, that's a good preset. All right, now let's go ahead and stick the little lighting a little bit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so with this, I mean like, when you're editing a lot, like it's really good when you just can like just use something, just drop it down, pick it back up, drop it down, pick it back up, you know what I'm saying? So that way you can go ahead and have a set idea of what you want. All right, so now, now this is looking pretty decent. Yeah, like, like this, yeah, yeah. Yeah, not too bad. All right, so now we're gonna go ahead and go to this one app that I just found. It's called Face App. Now this one's pretty cool. What this does, it brings more character into the face, you know, so you can actually, you know, dive in a little more detail with like, you know, these scars or, you know, in this case she has, you know, she has freckles. So I want to make sure I get those freckles out, make her face like very clear, you know, make her makeup a lot more, you know, just flawless. You know, girls like the type of stuff like, you know, like, a, you want to ask you want to ask them of course if they, you know if they want their you know beauty marks to be taken out like their molds or anything like that and they say yeah go ahead you know feel free to take that out make that as smooth as possible and you know give them that you know that that signature great look that, that, that they're looking for you feel me so we're gonna go to face app here and here too they they, they do have pretty good you know presets as well so the one i like here is either kiss or hollywood now with Kiss and Hollywood, they should pretty much add more definition into like the hair, the makeup, you know, the mascara, you know, all that good stuff that the girls be doing filming. So now I'm gonna go ahead and fix this up. Boom, pick that one. All right, now I'm gonna go ahead and go to, let me see. I'm gonna go ahead and go to like the more detail area. I can go ahead and pinpoint, you know, what I, what I, want, to, uh, what I want to like take out. So let's go ahead and get these freckles and moles out. So now, I got these freckles. Let me erase this a little bit. The best thing here, like, as I'm erasing them, you can't really, like, you can't really tell that it's erased. Like, it's, it, it's pretty good. It's pretty, pretty good th that the fact that, you know, it gets it real nice and clear and it makes it very just invisible. Like, even little, like, erase markers. So, like, that's pretty cool to me. Now we got this, I get the mole right here. You can just tap it, and I, I you just tap it. Go ahead and get it done a lot faster. Yep. All right, y'all, so. Now let's go ahead and fix this background a little bit here, make the background a little more, you know, a lot more black so that we can get all that, that, that black shade looking, you know, make it more just pop, make her pop out more, all right? So kind of pretty much like separating her in the background. So what we're gonna do is another thing I like. We can select both at the same time, or we can select either or. So let's, and we can like up the brightness or darkness, of course. Either, either the, the, the background or her herself, which is pretty dope. So let's go ahead and do the background real quick. 
So now, background, select. Now let me go ahead and just turn this up a bit. Yep. There we go, that looks a lot better. Yep, now let me go ahead and just select her, bring her a little more into the picture, like bring a lot more brighter. There we have it, y'all. There we go. That quick and easy and simple, really like, that's all you really need. You know, like you don't need like, you know, the version on your MacBook, whatever. Like me personally, I mean like, it depends on what you're, what you're doing. And yeah, like, if, but if you're doing more just like typical shots, you know, or like just portrait or, you know, stuff like that, you can easily just get away with it, which is, you know, some some mobile apps. You know, mobile apps are honestly become like one of the best things out in, like today. And you know, I'm, I'm grateful because I was I was, I went I was mobile ever since 2000 and like what I think ever since I was like teen. I never had like a laptop or I never had like a camera camera at first. So like I've always used my phone. So like now the fact that these are iPhones and these phones or whatever are coming out with these new you know apps or just upgrading their technology is freaking insane to me because there's a lot more things you can do like shoot <laughs> this video right here is, is going to get edited on my phone like bro i just i use like just good apps that i know that i know how to work them and i just pretty much can make sure i just use my creativity to make sure i make it like a lot better you feel me but um yeah so if you guys you know also want a video on how i make my videos as well you know, go ahead, you know, go ahead, drop a comment like, hey, just let me know, wait for something you feel, I'm gonna go ahead and bring that to y'all. But, uh, yeah, y'all, that's pretty much it right there. Hope you guys enjoyed. You know, keep making the photos, and like I always say, y'all.